is anathema. And if you guys are watching, I'm pretty sure you guys can squad stream this because they are streaming together. So oh, yeah. if you guys want to watch both sets at the same time, you can. You can actually do the Jarvis supercomputer <laughs> on 50 monitors if you wanted to. So oh, yeah, yeah, man. be my guest. Hey, <laughs> I, I, I respect the hustle, man. But right now, you're going to probably want to focus this one because of Marth versus Mario, MK Leo versus Karama, PS2, let's go. Interesting. And Leo opting for the Marth here. We're going back, pulling it back to Smash 4 days out here with the Marth coming out. Love to see it from Leo. Oh my god, a nice conversion there from MK Leo. Only gets a little bit of damage, but still, pretty good stage position here. Safe oh, yeah. fireballs from Kurama, trying to get that stage control. Yeah, Leo just looking pretty solid so far. But Kurama nice finally getting that parry, finally opening with the jab. Hey, not bad. I'm liking it right now. This is a pretty solid ultimate. Nice spacing on MK Leo, but the parry allows Kurama to get an opening. Nice mix up with the grab. And can we just talk about how Leo picked the white bar skin just to match the, the Mario the wedding, wedding outfit? outfit? Yeah, yeah to match the this vibes. It's a, there we this a nice regal it. match right now. This is oh, way yeah. more, this is way more oh. sophisticated, right? Nice that counter there counter. from MK Leo. Sends him off stage. Bad, that up, he hit below yeah, know, right? his legs. That, that was, was insane stuff. I thought, I thought it was space probably oh, uh, away from that. There's uh, something about Marth ledge. tippers that get that's it's just so satisfying, right? That F tilt. Oh, nice edge guard. Yeah, that's, that's not gonna kill just yet. Oh, oh wait, oh, it is. Was. Mars wow. Was a bit short on the recovery. Wow. Overestimated how large that uh, recovery was. I almost thought for sure Mario making it back, but nice yeah, edge guard there from MPLA. Perfect positioning. Back are gonna find an opening for Karama, really trying to take it slow, but the up tilt catching Karama dashing in. Oh yeah, I love that up tilt there, just catching the approach. The situation here gets sent off stage with the forward throw. He is careful here. Karama able to reset here. The back air again, gonna trade, send to the other side of the stage. Try to go for dash attack, but that might be too risky. Oh, Karama trying to catch Leo with the up oh, fireball. He did the melee recovery. You saw the side beat stall? <laughs> yeah, he did the side beat. That was a really good play. Oh, and the up smash from the roll. That's a classic for Mario. And now going to take the stock. Still not even percents, but could make it back here with a nice Mario combo. Got to be careful. Yeah, Leo doesn't want to give him too many openings with the pivot grab. Oh, yeah. Karama looking for an opening here. That's going to be a lot again. of percent here as well. Opting for the Nair finisher to try to get the Flood, but Kaleo going too far down to get the Flood. Yeah, Kaleo just fast falling, recognizing that uh, Kurama's looking for that Ooh, Flood the parry there. again finds Ooh, an opening. Kurama takes the stop. We running up the ceiling out here in okay. this wedding. What a way to go out there second time for Kurama. Ooh, double tipper up air. Not going to take the stock, but pretty good damage there from MK Leo and yeah. really good spacing. 120% here. Oh, oh wow, dude, these, these parries from Karama are insane, no? Like, yeah. he's getting so many openings because of them. Yeah, I think and Karama knows that that's the one way that he can find his openings versus Mark getting those parries, and he knows that he has to catch Leo's timing here. Oh, goes for down tilt, but not going to go for the edge guard. Nice low recovery from Karama, but gets back here off the roll get up. Let's see how he punishes. Oh, oh, get up attack, going to go unpunished there. from MK Leo. Try to go for Nair 1, gets it, still has to go for the reset. Back throw to put him back on the ledge. They're not going to kill just yet. Leo just hanging on. Oh, right. trying to go for oh. the up Oh, the S-Smash. Forward air S-Smash coming up. Karama just discovering that. Okay. Oh, bad here. Air Karama air, but trying to catch the up air, but not going to do it. The down tilt going to be an opening here for Karama, but going to go for the back air. Continues the pressure with the fireball. The S-Smash going to get spot dodged. I mean, Karama's been parrying everything. Oh, everything. my. But Tower Spot and Eric not going to kill Karama here. Oh, and a Leo nice stage the positioning there from MK the Leo. Yup, just catch, catching the roll there with the Nair. And we're still got a last stock here, game one. Yeah, last stock here, game one, but high percent here on MK Leo. And a nice reversal here for Karama, because we saw this situation here in the first stock where Karama was actually the one in the deficit, but now in the lead. Sends MK Leo off to the ledge. Let's see how he gets a punish, but the back air gonna catch MK Leo drifting a little bit too far away from the ledge. Has to be a regrab here. Gonna go for the downtown, but gonna whiff. MK Leo makes back it once again with the stuffing here. Karama is still in this, gets the parry, parry once again. But no punish. I mean, he's just parrying everything. I don't understand. Karama it's looking like Jazzo right now with these parries right. again. Oh my gosh. It's the up smash and shield off the can, down air. Can we get a parry counter in chat? This is insane. Actually, like, it must have been like almost like double digits in this one game. Wow. No flood Blood. there. Catch the up air. Is that going to kill you? Yeah, wow. Yeah, that percent, I mean, 187 yeah, percent there. Yeah. After yeah. the hit. Anything takes it almost. Anything takes it. And now, we're seeing game one going to Karama. Not sure if the other sets from the collision stats actually show uh, when Chroma took uh, the games that he did before, but 
Game one, the Krom is a pretty good sign on how this set's gonna go. Oh yeah, we might, oh, going back to PS2, so Leo will confirm going back to PS2 and giving Mario the stage uh, yeah, back to pick Marth. here, so. Yeah. Gonna go back to, to Marth. We well. might see Marth the whole set here, but we'll see what happens. Yeah, we might just continue on with the Mark. It wasn't looking too bad in game one. It was pretty close, pretty close, yeah. so. Not bad at all. Don't let the percentage fool you. Oh yeah. I mean, we've seen the Marth taking the same names like Riddles too, so. Definitely, Definitely. no slouch to high level play. Yeah. Let's see. Go. Going to game two, running back on PS2. I mean, I feel like the big thing there, Karama taking that main game mainly because of those parries, right? I mean, find a lot of openings against MKLeo's Mark because of the timings of those parries. So, oh yeah. And I like the movement there from Leo. He jumped completely around Karama's shield and then oh, yeah. delayed his back air there until Karama drop shield and got hit by that there. So, I'll throw up air. Gonna be a nice combo here, but not gonna get a full conversion. Look at the spacing from these two. Really playing safe. The down tilt going to catch MKLeo out of shield. And the down air going to seal the stock out. Closing it out. Oh. Mario is just so explosive. That was so efficient, too, for Karama. Nice awareness of his character, right? That character efficiency really showing it's Oh, yeah. I mean, that top hat, man, he just means business right oh, now. Yeah. <laughs> He's looking no spiffy, and he does definitely. not want to fool around, right? No shenanigans here from this Mario. Definitely. Ooh, nice conversion there from MKLeo. Gets some good damage and sets him on ledge. Try to catch the jump, but nice drift away from Karama. Landing down there, there also. Just a flood pushing Mark away. I like the spot dots there from Leo. And gets the up tilt. Force him on the platform, but Karama gets that stage positioning again. Better in the air tilt. I mean, how does Karama does do this? I'm just... He has no to way, know right? No way, he, I mean, right? He, 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 he must have been reviewing laws and just pricing time. I'm, I, I'm, I'm I don't know how does it do That's inhuman. That's task level parrying, right? I mean, oh, oh, but the what? shield break almost taking it. That shield looking smaller than a Skittle right now. Oh, oh side be nice. Yep, closing that out. Still in here. Leo needs to bring this back if he wants to have a chance here. Winner's side, top 64. Marth definitely having that capability of making this comeback, right? With those tippers, if you get a nice conversion here, you can take a stock as early as 50, so he's got to be careful. Definitely, he's got to be careful. Any hard read for Leo makes means just taking the stock. So, again, we're going to see one. Wow, trying to go for the tipper, but not going to connect. Yeah, just a little bit short there. Again with the side beat. Side beat 2, though, going to opt to cancel it. Yeah, it makes sense. Just uh, Karam SD on the way there. Karama really trying to find an opening, but really can't. MK Leo, so much pressure right now. Yeah, Leo's neutral right now is looking so good. Dang, that stage control. Look at this. I mean, this is super oh. high level in the up tilt to catch the no tech. That was so good. And now MK Leo's even this up. Yeah, just reacting to that so quickly, like you mentioned. Wow. Such good stuff here. Stuck on ledge, but the down tilt's going to find an opening for Karama, but not a true combo. Oh, Get the down tilt. The counter, will that take it? Nicely done, Karama. Wow. Really abusing PS2 there, right? I mean, we I mean, saw some insane combos thanks to that platform extension. Definitely. And I, I, I'm not going to lie. I don't agree with players taking Mario's PS2, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, I mean, that definitely like, is one of Mario's best stages. So I, I get it might be like a pride thing, but I think, Leo, you have to commit to maybe a different counter PS stage. Run it back again? Run it back? Chroma's like, sure, right? He's like, are you sure? Are you <laughs> Chroma's sure? Like, Chroma's asking Leo if for, he's sure he real? wants to run it back. He's like, really? <laughs> that ass? Mario. Sounds like Scooby now. Oh, who really? Lucina here? Lucina instead? I think so. Yeah. Yep, you are correct. So Lucina. To the character, to Lucina right, let's see. Maybe this is going to be the difference that actually allows uh, MKLeo to make a nice reverse 3 0. But Karama going to show us maybe a reprieve of Frostbite 2020. Oh, yeah. I mean, right now, this is looking like Karama's show right now. Oh, my God. What a oh, conversion. Wow. Sour Spot Forwarder not going to take the stock just yet, but still. MKLeo taking oh, so much percent. Almost barely. Oh, Krama is out for blood right now. Oh, Good wow. Parry the parry again. I mean, this is just a Karama show right now. The nice Leo reverse up tilt to catch the roll. Yeah, good positioning there from Leo, like you mentioned. Catching it after roll distance. Wow, back air going to miss by a barely pixel there. He missed that back air there. Wow. Krama gets the grab. Swatting the that, fireball, yeah. man. Yeah, Leo looking like a fireman out here with the fire extinguisher. Man. I do wonder if that uh, that wasn't able, or if, if MKLA wasn't able to do that with Martha, and that's why he switched. But no, it should be the same. Right? It should be the same. Yeah, yeah it, should be the same. it definitely felt better with Lucina, but fourth throw gonna send MKLA off stage here. 
Hits the up B. Makes it back on the stage, then they're going to find an opening. Same percentage here, both uh, players here, 135 apiece. Trying to catch that two frame angle with the downers, but still, Akilio has not been able to find one of those. Oh, the spot wow. dodge up tilt, gonna get it. The up tilt kills there. Nicely done. So early for Leo. That's gotta be so handy here. Game three. Still at 144, though. Oh, there it is. The back air is gonna take it. But Karama, so much stuffing on that back air, and it ain't even Thanksgiving right now. Wow. Very even game right now. The trade's going in favor of MP Leo. Gets that first step, but the downer gonna find an opening here for Kurama, opting to try to catch a landing here. The flood not gonna take the stock with the pivot grab. A little antsy with that upbeat from Leo. Okay, a little bit of movement. We're moving around here. Not bad. Yeah, that shield play. Neutral. Really not trying to get hit right now. Kurama taking oh. his time. Yeah, Leo just spot watching here, trying to avoid the grab. Two hits of side B, no follow up though. Wow, gets a parry again. Again, like, I think mean, just Kurama knows that he needs these parries to get the punishes. And that's a punish! The healing once again. Wow, dude, these what? ladder combos so good from Kurama. Kurama is maximizing every opportunity that Leo's giving Ooh, us. What a read, though, from again. MK Leo, the get up attack catch. Wow, Kurama that he had the get up attack space properly, but Leo catching it and just com completely punishing him. Double back here, there's gonna be a good opening for Kurama. Air dodges that. Reversal opportunity, but now MK Leo stuck on ledge once more. Let's see if Karama can catch it. The oh. S smash that seals out the S set three to zero. Catches the neutral. Karama moves on with another win on MK Leo. Wow, and then put a clean sweep of MK Leo. Oh yeah, that was huge for Karama here. Moving on in uh, winner side here. Wow. MK Leo definitely trying some unique picks right against the Mario. Really struggling to find an answer because we saw previously in Rise of Grind also another struggle against Mario. So maybe one of MK Leo problem characters. So definitely. If I'm not mistaken, I believe that pushes Kurama into top eight. Oh, I'm not that mistaken. Indeed? I believe that was eighth, ninth seed duking it out. So that should be the uh, game prior to entering top eight. So we're going to see Kurama in winner's side. Oh, but now we're seeing Cola versus Zomba next up. Oh, excuse me. I just checked back right now.